All right, so tomorrow the holidays officially begin at Disneyland Resort. So we are here with our last update in the series for 2018. You see the festival holidays sign which has been added overnight. It's everything ready to kick off here tomorrow morning. So that's that. We're going to make our way around the rest of Disneyland DCA. See what else we can find. Didn't see anything else really new in the downtown Disney area. So uh, we'll see what we find in the parks. And at Red Wolf Creek, it has reopened as Santa's holiday visit again. Fun little stuff on display. Let's head inside and see if uh, it's ready to go. All right, right when we walk in, the Redwood Creek Challenge Trail has the Elf Games. Telling us where everything's hidden inside. And over here is where Santa will be meeting and greeting. All the letters for him, other decor. And although unofficial festival holidays is underway, here we're at the Winter Sliderland booth. Merry Miniature Holiday Feast. We got the roasted turkey slider, holiday stuffing, mac and cheese, and milk chocolate candy cane. And then obviously as we hit the main thoroughfare over there, got more booths open. We'll do video of all of them, but we'll show a little bit more. All right, and making our way over to what has been the last several years, our favorite part of design holidays, even Navidad. Love the street parade, love the characters, love just the decor, everything over here. Uh, also to note, not that it does anybody any good watching this, but Thursday night, uh, much of the entertainment is going, at least here in DCA, which has been uh, pretty consistent over the last few years. Not sure if Viva Navidad is going, but uh, we'll be looking around. We did have a grab video of the Toy Soldiers. They're back with almost an identical performance to last year, but uh, we'll throw that video up on the YouTube channel tonight. If interested in checking it out. And Paradise Garden Grill is not open, but we can see their menu here, what's going to be offered this season. Besides that, a bit of decor up here and there in the background area, obviously the staging. And over here, photo op area still set for Elena of Avalor, or I should say set for Elena of Avalor. And then the beginnings of some stuff getting set up over here. And over here we have the stage not only set, but actually Cars Land, this is an area we haven't done anything really much with the video and the update this year just because of time restraints and not making it over. But you see tow maters ready, we've got the wreaths up high there, and really decor the whole way through. So we'll take you and show a little bit. Cars land, looking good. About ready to go for tomorrow. And yeah, actually, I think all the booths are open at this point for Festival of the Holidays. So, all up and down here already open. 
some good looking food, lots of good, uh, overpriced in my opinion, but I was eating the multi-buy pass, which helps out a little bit. Uh, we did try the macaroni stuffing thing, which was $7.75, and it was very good, but again, very small, but a good little treat. Disneyland and like last night the tree is lit, Christmas music's playing, but in addition the star is lit tonight, so that was not lit last night. And then across the way, Walt's little tree is up above the firehouse as well, so we'll make our way in Disneyland. Not sure if there's much more that we haven't already put on video in here, but we'll look around. All right, and we are exiting the park and wrapping up the series. Not much new to see inside Disneyland. I mean, uh, it's a small world, uh, but that'll be its own thing. And now uh, we'll check that out as everything opens up tomorrow fully. Uh, so a short series of update videos for Disneyland holidays this year, but uh, never as much as Halloween, just because Halloween starts getting the decor so much earlier. And uh, Christmas, it's all kind of crammed into a little over a week's time. So hopefully you enjoyed those videos following the progress. And as I said, we'll have a lot more videos throughout November and December that bring some of the Disneyland Christmas time stuff. We'll definitely head out to the hotels, see everything they have going on there as that comes together a little bit later in the run. And uh, yeah, performances, characters, treats, all sorts of stuff. So we'll wrap up here and until next time, we'll see you in line somewhere.